My presentation looks at unpaid overtime work by Canadians using the federal government's open data resources. This topic is interesting to me because I've worked both paid and unpaid overtime in the past. It can be frustrating to not be paid for extra work that you do, even if you agree to structure your work hours that way. I'm curious about the actual value of unpaid overtime and if there's a trend overall or within certain industries. I'm focusing on two data sets published by Statistics Canada from 1997 to 2020. The first is employee overtime by industry, specifically the hours of unpaid overtime that Canadians work per week. And the second is employee wages by industry to capture hourly wages. By multiplying values from these data sets together, I hope to answer the following question. What earnings are lost by workers doing unpaid overtime? My goal is to present these unpaid overtime hours with average dollar values. For the purposes of this assignment, this is a high level analysis using averages between the two data sets. Also, the overtime hours analyzed only apply to workers who do unpaid overtime. The visualization shows the average unpaid wages for overtime work per week. So if you make $20 an hour and you work four hours of unpaid overtime in a week, then the unpaid wage would be $80. To simplify, we can just look at the top three and bottom three based on 2020 values. The top three are industries where unpaid overtime costs the workers the most. The bottom three cost workers the least. For trends, there's a general increase in unpaid wages in all industries over the years, but it's not out of line with inflation. This information helps quantify what some Canadians are willing to do for free. But to put it in another perspective, if we take the 2020 weekly values and turn them into yearly, on average, overtime workers miss out on $7,200 to over $22,000 per year by working unpaid. A final point to make is the focus here is on the dollar values rather than the amount of work hours. In the data set for unpaid overtime hours, the industries with the highest average of hours of unpaid overtime are agriculture, which was 14 hours per week in 2020, and educational services, which was 10 hours per week in 2020. The value of the hours of unpaid work can be subjective depending on the worker, so there are certainly alternative ways to interpret these two data sets. Thank you for listening to my presentation.